So good morning from Siem Reap and today what are we doing? Go to Floating Village. Let's go. My tuk tuk. Predicted the rain is heaving it down, so it's gonna pull down the side bits, and then we should have a bit of protection from the elements. Raining in Cambodia. Beautiful. This is rural Cambodian life, village life. Just the markets and the selling, all that delicious fruit down there. People asleep on hammocks next to coconuts. This is the real Cambodia. Quality of the road, not quite as good. Yeah. So we just stopped here at the Kampong Pluk Community Ecotourism and you buy your tickets from here. Uh, I think the government have, have sort of taken over it, sort of like regulated it, so it's all a bit more above board than what it used to be perhaps. So that's why it's like $20 each, quite pricey, but. Thank you. Welcome. Thank you. So that's where we were and we've sort of come down to this area and then we're gonna, this is where we're gonna be going around this sort of Buying some provisions first for the journey. Get some Diet Coke and Coke. But it looks like it's going to start raining again. But we are in the wet season. That's why the water is already this far down. Because in the dry season, we'll be going for ages before we'd see any water. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go. Despite the rain starting again. We've got to drive from nine kilometers all the way down here till we get to this little bit. Then we'll get a boat and go on the river. Nice day for a boat ride. I don't actually mind that it's raining. Yeah, it cools it down. Are they safely moored for the journey? Are they safe? who live here. 700. How good does this look? Like we 
we've got a scheduled stop. Come on, you can do it, Celine. <laughs> Ooh. Right. And in this little pit here, crocodiles. Let's have a look. Siamese crocodiles. What's going to happen to them? Oh, nothing bad. So yeah, people, when they come to Siam Reap, they do the temples, but then if they've got a spare day, they do this floating village tour. And I think the next part is we're going to get one of these smaller ones and go through the mangrove for 30 minutes. I think that's what's going to happen. Does it feel sturdy? A bit more of a quieter, leisurely journey. Some woman rowing me. I like it when the woman rows. Future reference. Proper mangrove forest. You all right back there? This is why I was reluctant to do this, because of you on a boat. Basically, I just moved slightly to the left and the button tipped over. And this is why you get your pay your five dollars, because you get some safety equipment. I wonder if there's actually crocodiles in this river. I know they're critically endangered, but... I'd say all the crocodiles are in this river in that pit. Yeah. starting again but we've been equipped with umbrellas but look how good this looks there's a temple at the end this looks fantastic it's about 3,000 people who live in that 700 families This has been good this bit, hasn't it? Fantastic trip. Yeah, this is better than the, uh, the first boat ride. Look how I'm travelling. I've got the uh, business class seat. How is it in economy? Mm -hmm. Stop complaining about economy. Business, you might spoil my business class. Cambodian crocodile farms breed and sell live crocodiles, usually to buyers in China, Thailand, Vietnam, where they're harvested to make crocodile leather and other products. That is sad actually. That is really sad. Huge designer brands too yeah. The uh, boat lady has spotted a primate. Thus I'm out of my business class seat. She must have the eyes of an eagle. I heard it rustling but I didn't see it. No monkey business. on the bananas. Nice, sweet, sweet delicious. Do you want one? Yes, please. And we're off again on this boat. Where to? I don't know. Do you like it? Highlight then, do you think? Um, the wee pompo through the mangroves, definitely. Yeah, the little one. I like that. Except for when you nearly coped it over. I know, right at the beginning. But yeah, here we are. Back at the jetty, let's find our driver. You're actually scared too. And if you're wondering what type of boat we're on, it's a Nissan. Just in case you're wondering. Thank you. Thank you very much. Floating village. Where is it? Canton. Finished. Back to CM Reap. Next stop will be Vietnam. Tonight. See you there tomorrow.